Hello. Hello, good people. Hello, good people. I am Dr. Holly Kelly, and this is Dr. Kelly's Perspective for Tuesday, May 9th, 2017. 2017. I promise I will not be with you long today because I am in pain. <laughs> that dental issue we were talking about? Okay, well, all that surgery took place earlier today, so um, I'm getting ready to go crawl back in the bed as soon as I finish. But, you know, it, it won't take me very long to say um, what is on my heart and mind today because it is this. There is not any level of family, institutional, national entity that does not rise or fall on leadership. Nothing. You cannot name, you cannot concoct a situation that does not mandate leadership done in excellence if the results are going to come out positive for the greater good. So, so whether, whether or not you lead a family, a faith-based organization, a global industry, leadership is important and it matters. What you do as a leader matters. And as a matter of fact, the greater your reach, the more expansive your platform is, the the more powerful the impact becomes because it is always going to be more than just you. It is always going to be more than just you. There will always be second, third, and fourth order effects. Okay, thank you for all who are joining with me today, um, this evening. Always going to be critical that we lead well. Now I'm looking around today at what is happening in our nation today in particular within our administration and it makes it crystal clear to me again that leadership is vital and it is necessary. It's not optional. There has to be more than charisma involved and I'm not speaking as a Republican, a Democrat, uh, an Independent. I am speaking as someone who has been given a platform. So please don't use this or don't even think about this as a, well, he should have, and that happened, and I can't believe this, because we're wasting time when we do that. I'm really urging you, and again, how wide your platform is, okay, whether you're leading a family, whether you're leading a unit of, of 500, whether you are leading at a tremendous organization, I'm going to ask that you turn the mirror, clean it up first, make sure it's, it's clear, no specks, no, no distractors in the mirror, because the distractors will get us off base and will allow us to say, well, he and she and cast the blame and come up with excuses. So clean the mirror and get crystal clear to yourself. Ask the question. Check yourself to ensure that whatever platform you have been given to lead, that you are doing it in excellence, that your character is on point, that you're cleaning it up, that you have the courage to lead, that you have the courage to lead, that you are competent as a leader, that you care enough about those that you are leading that you will do the right thing because it has got to be more than about self. It has to be, it always is. There will always, you cannot give me a situation, you cannot point out a circumstance, an example. Thank you so much, Eric. You can't give me an example where, um, well, I was just doing that and it didn't involve anybody but me. It didn't hurt anybody but me. That's a distractor. There's a cloak. There's a cloak that is, that is over our minds that allows us to believe the lie that, oh, okay, this will not affect anybody but me. This only affects me. It never will end with you. Others are always involved. And so I'm just asking, as we look around at what is going on, going on in our lives, personally, 
even all the way to a global situation check yourself if God has given you a platform to lead in any capacity make sure you are doing it in excellence because others are involved others will be involved others will be impacted with every decision you make every decision you do not have the courage to make every time you you um you you lack the compassion to care about all those that are involved it matters it matters okay that is all i am going to give tonight on this perspective um I will see you Thursday. Until then, take real good care. Clean that mirror and recognize the truth and the reality that what you do as a leader matters. It still matters. Take good care.